guys, so I just got filming, done filming this look, and it was an inspired look, and I think you guys know by what. But I just wanted to let you guys know that all I used was BH Cosmetics, so I didn't even use the palette that they have with this. And um, you guys, obviously, I can recreate something without using a palette, so can you guys. So if you ever have a look that you want to recreate by me, and you have different eyeshadows, then go for it and use another palette that you own and that you can recreate. So here is the look, and um, I guess we kind of look alike. Um, there it is, with the eyes closed. So it was really fun to recreate. This is a Maybelline, their new like uh, line and like eyeshadow, and I really like it. So I decided to just recreate it with my own eyeshadow palette. And if you guys want to see how I did it, stay tuned and keep watching. So the first thing that we need is our MAC um, Bare Study Paint Pot. And we're going to apply this all over our lid and it's going to act as a base. Next we're going to be taking our 88 Colors Palette Standard Matte Eyeshadow by BH Cosmetics. And where I got this will be linked in the down bar. And we're going to be using our e.l.f. Professional Eyeshadow Brush with this. And um, the color that we're going to be using, this green right here, which is a nice like green, which will act as our base for all the other greens. And we're going to be applying this on our base, um, underneath our brow bone, and kind of winging it out a little. Taking the BH Cosmetics again and then Lauren F Crease Brush, we're going to be taking um, this one and we're going to be applying this onto um, the outer one third of our eye and um, I'm going to be showing you how we slowly pat it on and kind of intensify the green. So to add that white highlighty glow underneath the line and to give it uh, to define it, we're going to be using Elf's facial shimmering whip. Now we're going to be applying this very nice yellowish white color underneath our brow bone as our highlight, and we're going to be using um, the Urban Decay Caramel Brush. So I went ahead and intensified the um, crease. You guys can see that I brought it a lot closer to the brow bone. That's what you want to do. You're just going to take and mix those two colors and kind of um, bring it closer and closer. And um, now we're just going to take the highlight. So it's just a little bit of black liner in the picture and it's eyeshadow obviously because that's the whole look. And what we're going to do is take our Lorna liner brush and this black right here and then apply it onto our upper lash line. ahead and curl our lashes and apply falsies. So this is it. This is the final look for the eyes. And um, here's what they look like. So if you guys like this tutorial and um, it was very fun to recreate and now I'm gonna go on to lips and for cheeks I'm taking Elf's Contour and Blush Bronzing Palette. I'm gonna take the pink um, and then I'm going to take the Lorna face brush. First, I'm going to chapstick my lips using Carmex, then using Revlon and Soft Nude, I'm going to apply this to my lips. And then, all in all, using Maybelline, um, and I'm not sure what the number is, but this is just a really nice lip gloss. So here it is, here is the completed look. Uh, I think it looks really good, especially with the dark hair, because green and black look really pretty together. And I hope you guys like it. Thanks so much for watching.